それは TMNT 時間です。Was that correct? I、uh, know. It's TMNT time in Japanese because I'm gonna have a look at something I've talked about recently in TMNT Toy Throwback Big in Japan episode 2. Go watch it. Now, now, go watch it. If you haven't seen it, it's amazing. Like, seriously. I'm very proud of that. I'm very happy with the series. But regardless of that, let's not plot my own stuff too much. Well, I mean,、um, I have all the rights to do that. Anyhow, I'm gonna have a look at the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Super Turtles, Super Saint, I mean, Turtle Saint, a lot of Super.、Uh, reason I have this now is because after I did the Big in Japan episode, I went on the internet and I was like, God damn it, I wanna have some of these. I wanna have a look at the Japanese turtles. I wanna know if they're different because you have a different packaging and all that, and they look different. So I couldn't find the four turtles, but even better, I found a turtle saint at a reasonable price. Now, who's a turtle saint? That's basically when all four of these Superman legend turtles combine into the turtle saint. <laughs> What is this? What is this? I don't. I, 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 I'm speechless. I don't know what to say.、Uh, not even a look. I mean, looks cool. I like the look. I'm just bamboozled about what the hell is going on over here. And. My question has been answered. I was wondering how much difference the Japanese version was from the American. The answer is very, very much. Like, it's not even the same figure. Especially the articulation. I'm just.、Uh, okay. Step one height, size of this guy, and that's where it starts. He's a lot smaller than the、uh, American Super Turtles. He stands at about. 13 and a half centimeters really to the top of his crown, which means he's、uh, a little shy of five and a half inches, I'd say. Now, the paint job, there's a whole lot of gray. And gray is definitely not the first thing I think about when I think turtles. There's, there's not even any green. Why? Are the same turtles, you know, if, if a turtle goes to heaven, does it go gray? I don't know. I guess it's just supposed to be like metal and stuff. So, we retain the colors of the turtles. You have the blue head mask for Leonardo, you have the purple wristbands and armbands for Donatello, you have the red knee pads for Wrath, and you have like ankle bands in orange for Mikey, and the rest is all gray.、Uh, this is obviously chrome, as you can tell. They have a sticker in there. They have just a, a sticker, a sparkly sticker, which looks really bad. Like, even for back then. That looks really bad. And a nice chrome shell. That looks cool though.、Uh, of course, we retain the entire look of the super mutant, super hero, superman, whatever it was called. Super mutant hero, superhero, superman. I'm stopping now.、Um, we retain that design for this guy, of course. I'm just gonna move over to the articulation because this is, that's, that's where the really funny part starts. First of all, the hat doesn't move around because it can, this guy can transform. This guy can transform in like two. He has two transformations, and I, I, don't, I don't know. It's just so weird to me. So, first problem over here、um, these things are not connected to the shoulders. They're just floppy over here, which, once again, is part of the transformation. Problem with that is that I move the arms around, and it's just like. I mean, it's still floating somewhat on there. And as you can tell, that is the arm articulation. I don't know why they have this huge gap over here. I mean, it's cool that you can. Bring it out to the side. It is basically on a swivel, but they left some space so you can move it around like that. And this, this is soft plastic, it's just floppy connected over here, and it just flops around <laughs> all over the thing. And you have nothing else going on nothing, no swivels over here, but you have all the swivels in the world down here. First of all, what the hell is this? What is this? Bam! The, we have a swivel. On top of a swivel, dog. If you didn't like your swivels, how about having your swivels with more swivels on swivel? I don't know what this is supposed to accomplish. Please. This is. I mean, why would I swivel it out like that if I could just have the entire leg swivel out? Like. I, I don't know. I, I really don't know.、And、then we have another swivel over here, and、uh, then you have another swivel over here. Once again, like in an angle. Like, what, what, does, that, what does that do? And we have none at the foot. Oh, we have one at the foot. Never mind. Okay. 
This articulation is hella wonky, and then that's that's really all I got to say about that. Now let's get to the good stuff. What you're really here for? I don't think this is the whole. I don't think this form is really a form. It's just like the basic figure. But we're really we're really here for the turtle saint, and for the entire turtle saint experience, you need upgrades like I don't know this shield with another sticker on it because that one was so great last time. We're just gonna do it again. So they put this on his back. It doesn't really have anything to hold it on. It just kind of just slides into the uh, the things, the pegs that hold the shoulder pieces, and then you have the belt with the T on it for turtles. <laughs> of course, and you just uh, I just slide that in there, I guess. Yeah, I mean I slid it on one side, but what about the other side? A few moments later. So this is one of those classic moments where you slide one part in and the other part just slides out and one, once you get all of them in, all of this will not be connected anymore. So that's that's amazing. I mean, if you have fun doing this, this, this figure will be a blast to you and all your hobbies and it just falls down. You know, you have like flat feet and everything. Just stay up there. Alright, that's also articulated. You have the wings because he's a saint, obviously. And you also have a sword for your saintness, the turtle saintness. And uh, it's pretty big. I don't know why he has a sword. That's like uh, favoring Leo much. But yeah, that's your Turtle Saint version. Uh, a lot of gray plastic. I don't. I don't really know why. Why does this not have at least somewhat of a darker tone to match the rest of the body? It's just like it's standing out so weirdly. But I guess that's the tone of this figure. Weird. But wait. Wait, there is indeed more. I mean, first of all, you can have this and use it as a shield. I'm just gonna show you that real quick. And, uh, I mean, they have a handle that you just have to pull out. I'm probably gonna fail miserably at it. No, no, there you go. Just pull that out. Can't get it out more. And there you go. You pull that out. You put that up. And I guess you somehow, there was some picture of the belt just also going. In there somewhere, it doesn't matter, but you put this together and you also have a turtle shield. If you don't want to have the saint with his wings, you can use it as a shield. But we're gonna get to the good part now. The utter transformation into a turtle. Yes, a great turtle, even though I don't... Does he even have all these forms? Isn't this supposed to be the ultimate saint? The combination of all the turtles? Why does he have a turtle form? I don't know. You know what? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter! We're gonna get to the turtle form. First of all, I have to disconnect the shell, and I'm already failing at it. Put this down, and you put this down. I mean, you pull this down. You have the hat, you have the turtle hat in here. Rotate this up. So, alright, the shell stay over there. You rotate the turtle hat up, and you close it down. Okay, so far so good. That looks better already. <laughs> Now, as far as part of the wonky articulation goes, apparently, if I'm understanding this correctly, I have to spin this around and the foot to have it more like a, a lean to it. So that makes it more like a turtle. I, uh, those are the instructions, guys. I, I'm just I'm just doing what they're telling me to do. And you're also pulling this weird piece up. Apparently, hold on. If I can get to that. This thing is going up. And this thing is going down. That's not. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. So that's what that's for. I can see the light now. I have been, uh. I don't know, educated, I guess. Joke's on you, you stupid um, European. You don't know what Japanese engineering is really for. Also, I completely forgot about this, but you can put out this to have some blades. I forgot about it. Because it's dumb, alright? Just saying. And then you'll have your turtle, right? No, just kidding. Then you put this piece over here. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna YOLO this. I don't I I'm not looking at the instructions right now, so I'm gonna horribly fail connecting these two pieces, which should be super easy, right? Super easy. Super easy. First try, no edits, no nothing. No, this is I just did it. Um all jokes aside, that actually looks cool. I like that. That's so weird, but still, it's a turtle. It looks it looks a lot less weird than anything else I've seen so far. We got the Leo head mask. You get the T for turtle once again. 
Well, not a T on the back, I don't know, kind of overkill, but it's also nice and chrome, once again. I like my chrome, I like shiny things because I'm stupid. Also, you can see me in here. Hi! I like this farm a lot better, this this looks familiar. This is, this is definitely a turtle, this is no sainting around. And also, if you want to know the size, since he lost some size, he's actually down to 12 centimeters now, a little under 5 inches. Because of spinning all these legs around. That's actually kind of nifty, even though it's super wonky as far as articulation goes, and then this all this connects and would got that. These are also the best instructions of my life. I mean you have the regular figures, blah blah blah, painting, stairs, the picture of the figure. But then the darkness age is over. It actually has a comic. It has a comic, which for some reason you have some English over here, and then whoop, Japanese. With Shredder turning into a dragon. Yep. Shredder turns into a dragon. And then they're like, No way, dude! Pizza power! And stuff. And then they turn into the turtle saint. I like the artwork. It's... It's very anime. It's, it's really... I mean, it's manga. And you have some more pictures of the super mutant, superhero mutant, super turtles. Oh my god. I, I will never, ever get that title right. And you have the dragon Shredder. Which I also have, by the way, in a recolor, though. I don't have the purple one, I have the black one. And let's see what's on the other side. I mean, those are just instructions for transforming and whatnot, but, uh, yeah. Great! And we're back in the Turtle Saint form to wrap things up, but one more thing. You have this red ooze canister, which I don't really know what's the point of it, because they had muta stones to further mutate into super mutant, and I think that was purple. Anyhow. Um, Turtle Saint. Final thoughts? This, this is everything I ever hoped for, and even more. I mean, it's it's wonky, it's funny, it's out of the box. I like it! The only thing like I'm legit not agree with is the lack of a swivel in the hand. Everything else, I mean, this is a toy from 1995, so I can't really be too harsh on it. But like I'm saying, it's, it's, it's different, it's out of the box, it's cool. The articulation is pretty decent, and the look of it is also nice, I like the chrome and everything. Now as far as the overall lightness go, it's really, really hard to find some clear pictures of this guy. But from what I can tell, this is pretty spot on, you have the T logo, and uh, I mean the chrome is looking somewhat purplish, if I'm not mistaken, because in the, uh, in the pictures I've seen, his entire chest piece looks pretty purple. Probably to go with Donnie's purple armbands and, you know, whatnot. I mean, it, it works. And it's gonna wrap things up. Do I recommend this? I mean, yeah, like I said, it's, it's super wonky if you can find it, of course. I mean, this is 95. Go check it out. As usual, guys, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget, if you enjoyed this review, feel free to hit it up with a like. And maybe subscribe to the channel so you can stay tuned for more figure videos, gameplay stuff, and whatever. The Turtle Saint wants.